Lord Sakai! A moment, please. It's important. Yes. What is it? Not out here, my lord. This way. My name is Hyo. This is my shop. Are you trying to sell me something? Oh, no, my lord. Ah, here should be fine. No one's listening. Tell me what this is about. My neighbor, Haruo. He's acting suspicious. He sneaks out of town at sunset. Gone for hours. Comes back at dawn. Last night I followed him. He went to a burnt-out house by the cemetery and met bandits there. Bandits? That can't be good. I'll find this house and learn what they're up to. Thank you, Yuri. Of course, my lord. We'll get some rest soon. Negum bed. Ah! <laughs> 
Merchant and Ezra, you said his neighbor met bandits here. Seems deserted. I'll have a look around. Lots of ashes. Campfire's been used many times. Hmm. Someone's meal, eaten recently. Old bandages. Not much blood. Minor wounds. The merchant was right to be suspicious. Need a place to hide. Wait for the merchant's neighbor and his bandit friends to return. Any trouble getting out of Hazamo? No. But I saw Mongols on the roads. I think they're looking for us. We should hurry. What did you bring this time? The statue of Inari. Oh, that's valuable. I'm surprised the Mongols didn't take it. Let's bury it with the rest. Thieves. Need to see where they take things. Keep your eyes open for trouble. How are the others? Hiding. Mongols rode by the house a few times. But so far, everyone is safe. You hear that? Forces! Mungo! Hi! They're gone. Let's go. <sighs> we were lucky. They caught poor Tamun out on the road. The patrols are getting worse. Must be that samurai. He's got Mongols chasing him all over the prefecture. I hope he kills the bastards. Almost there. The sooner we're off the road, the better. What happened to Tamon? The Mongols impaled him on top of an anthill. Screamed for an hour. That's horrible. Let's hurry and finish this. What are they doing? I hate burying a night like this. Better in a grave than a Mongol ship. They don't sound like thieves. Hurry up! Something's not right. <sighs> yeah, Inari is safe. That's enough. Don't move. Dad, I knew we'd been followed. Wait, it's the samurai. I'm glad it's you, my lord. That's a strange reaction from a thief. We're not thieves. You drove the Mongols from Azamo Bay. But what if they come back to raid us? We're hiding the most important things from our shrine. Just in case. Sotaro! Kihei! Come quick! Ukon, you shouldn't have left the others. The Mongols found the house. Our people are trapped! They will be killed! How many Mongols? I couldn't count them all. Which of you can fight? Me and Kihei. You're with me. You two get in the house and protect your people. With what? Everything you've got. Ready? Your sky! Osho! Dojo! Dojo! More coming! We should have run! They're not giving up! 
Bastards get in? No, you kept them away. Not us. It was Lord Sakai. Who are these people? Travelers fleeing the Mongols. People who lost their homes. And you protected them. We tried. You're not hiding those valuables so you could steal them later. No, my lord. We're not trying to get rich. After seeing what the Mongols have done, we only want to help. Huh. Then help me lead these people to Azamo Bay. You'll all be safe there. Stop! I know bandits when I see them. You're not welcome here. They're with me. These people need shelter. Even the bandits. My lord, they can't be trusted. They fought to defend these people. They hope you hold this town. As you wish, my lord. Open the gate! Let everyone inside! I don't know how to thank you, Lord Sakai. Protect Azamo like you did those people. I promise I will. And make sure they know where to find what you buried when the Mongols are finally gone. You can count on it. Thank you for this chance to prove myself. My brother wanted to be a samurai, Lord Sakai. He built a bamboo training stand, spent a whole winter practicing on it. Bamboo cutting. An excellent way to become a better swordsman. Perhaps I can join your brother in practice. Sadly, 
He died of fever a few years ago. But every time I see a stand beneath its flag, I think of him. And now, so will I. Thank you. Take care. Lord Sakai! Kenji, what are you doing here? Something has gone very wrong, my lord. What did you do? Nothing! The Mongols have taken all our food. Rice, millet, fish, anything they can lay hands on. We're starving. You say we. This isn't your farm. I have been thinking about what you said. And I'm trying to help the farmers here. Where the Mongols camped. Who knows, they show up every few days and pick up the food and cart it away. I could ambush them. It's not that simple. They've taken hostages. If we don't produce the food, it's... <gasps> there must be a way to find them. There is. You won't like it. I will decide that for myself. I'll show you. They make us bundle the food and put it on the beach. All of it from this farm? The farm. Scavenging abandoned homes, fishing and hunting, just to fill the bellies of the enemy. What brought you here in the first place? Once the Mongols connected me to you, most places got too dangerous. I thought an out-of-the-way farm would be safer. Food and drink for the Mongols, but the sake barrel is empty. Your plan is to anger the Mongols more? Not exactly. The barrel is very roomy. It could hold a heavily armed heroic samurai. You know what would fit better? A flabby, flexible sake merchant. The Mongols will take the barrel to the heart of their camp. Who could do more good there? Me or you? I don't know why I keep letting you hide me inside things. Because it works. It smells like your breath in here, Kenji. Well, that barrel didn't empty itself. Get ready, my lord. Here they come. Udigen uh, Tergendach. Yes, yes, all yours. Take, take. Faster Moriga. No, no, no. That's Miko. Uh, Miko is my horse. Mine. Nadamatat. More big nick for salt. Ow! You can't do this! Miko! No! His plan actually worked. Negu Harsinta.
won't believe it. We are saved. Take this food back to your farm. Give Kenji the good news. Kenji? Why would I give him anything but a punch in the mouth? What do you mean? He's the idiot who got us into this mess. He tried to cut a deal with the Mongols. Oh, Lord Sakai. That was amazing. Kenji, you suck his swilling piece of monkey dung. I'll handle this. Explain yourself. I might have sold the Mongols food, but given them straw and wood chips instead. To make a profit? To save the farmer's food. You didn't think the Mongols would notice? Mm, not so quickly. All of a sudden, it was punishment, hostages. Give us food or we kill you. I was wrong to encourage you to make yourself useful. What? No, no. No, you weren't wrong, Lord Takai. I can do good. I just need practice. Try not to practice when people's lives are at stake. Yes, my lord. You're damn lucky that samurai spared you, Kenji. I'm sorry, Taro. I was trying to help. You want to help? Choke on a rice ball. I can tell you don't want to talk about this right now. Goodbye. Set yourself on fire and mate with a Mongol bomb. <laughs> Okay. 